Hey there, mobile pupils. I am Paul Sawada, and I am over printed textbooks. You will be too by the end of this Mobile Minute. So what's my beef with these wordy tree killers? Well, they're overpriced, they're overweight, they're out of date, and they can't do a fraction of the things these can do. Bringing your phone to class used to be a one-way ticket to detention. Trust me, I'd know. Fortunately, schools all across the country are easing up on their outside technology policies. Pew Research says 73% of teachers now allow smartphones and tablets inside the classroom. Regardless of academic level, all students could benefit from quiz apps, like EduPad. EduPad is a personal tutor for K-12 graders that offer additional practice in all subjects, from math and reading to SAT prep and foreign languages. Even parents can get on the educational app game. Take Common Core, for example. It makes it easy for parents to look up teaching standards for their children's school district, holding educators accountable. And if a parent wants to continue their education, the popular free language app Duolingo is an excellent alternative to pricey software. Sprechensee savings? And soon, the entire family can learn to speak the most important language of all, code. The new PlayEye system features two friendly robots, Bo and Yana, both certified to teach your toddler to speak web dev. Look for it this summer. So do you see why textbooks should go the way of the dinosaurs? Now we just need developers to keep building educational apps, parents to write superintendents, and companies with extra money to invest in classroom tech. And that's your mobile minute.